Hey guys, and welcome to my quick guide for the Mogra Law activity. Now, you need to have completed this to be able to get the Necromancer's Flippers, which is needed to level up the Necromancy equipment to level 50. So to complete this, you will need to have level 20 cooking. You'll need to have some nettle tea, which is made by adding nettles to a bowl of water and cooking it. You'll need a bucket of water, chocolate dust, a bucket of milk and snake grass. Now, if you don't know where to get the nettles, I will put the picture on screen of where to get them in Drano Village. So to start the quest, you need to head southeast of Rimmington. Once you get there, go ahead and speak to Skippy. Go through the chat, choose option two, who are, dramatic pause, they. Hold spacebar and go through the chat once again. Once you're done, right click on Skippy and choose Sober Up. And then choose option one, throw the water. You should throw the bucket of water at him. If he's moving around, it won't work. So you just have to right click and choose the same option again. Go through the chat with him. He'll ask you for some nettle tea. So go ahead and speak to him again with the nettle tea in your inventory. If you haven't made it, you just need to put nettles into a bowl of water and cook it. Go through all this chat again. And then he'll ask for a hangover cure. So now you need to use chocolate dust on your bucket of milk to get chocolatey milk. And then use the snake grass on the chocolatey milk to get a hangover cure. Then speak to Skippy once again. Go through his chat and that will be the activity completed. He'll have a bit more to tell you about Mogras. Um, but once this is complete, you'll have the ability to slay Mogras once you've got level 32 Slayer. And it also unlocks the ability to own a giant crab pet after you've done the Freeing Pirate Pete subquest of Recipe for Disaster. So, activity completed.